Hello, my name is Dia Vadhwani and I will be your instructor for this course. In this course, we will learn all the concepts about cloud and Azure that you need to know for giving this examination named Microsoft Azure Fundamentals AZ900. This is the most basic and the first examination that you have to give if you want to prove yourself or you want to get certified un under Microsoft Azure. Before talking more about this course, let us first understand what exactly is Azure, what exactly you people are going to learn. So Azure is a public cloud offering by Microsoft. It provides many cloud services for both business and private use. A student can also register on the Azure platform if he or she wants to learn more about cloud computing. So basically, Azure is a cloud computing platform. Using Azure, you can create virtual machines, you can use cloud storage, you can use cloud networking model, you can understand more about how exactly, you know, cloud collaborates with databases, uh, networking, security, and many more things. We will be going through each and every topic that, you know, you need to know if you want to give this exam or you just, or you are just getting started with cloud. So the name of the exam is exam AZ900 Microsoft Azure Fundamentals. Anyone can take this exam with basic cloud knowledge. And uh, the price of the exam is approximately about 99 USD dollars. Exam portion was updated on November 9, 2020. This course has been uh, you know made by keeping in mind the new syllabus so you do not need to worry about updates i will keep updating this course as the syllabus changes as of now this course is up to date now we will be discussing all the table of content which is available on the microsoft website also and all these skills you need to know if you are going to give this exam so the first one is describe cloud concepts the second is described core as your services. Third one is described core solution and management tools on Azure. Fourth one is described general security and network security features. Fifth one is described identity, governance, privacy and compliance features. Sixth one is described as your cost management and service level agreement. We will be discussing each one of these in detail. You just need to go through each one of these if you want to give this exam. This is the updated syllabus, which is also available on Microsoft website if you want to go through it. Uh, now, we will be discussing each one of the section one by one. 